Today I want to talk to you guys about the GeForce RTX 5080. I just got this in. I do a lot of video editing and I'm hoping this will help me uh, go through a lot of 4K videos because right now I have uh, this one here. If you can see that, there's the GeForce RTX 2070. So I'm going uh, quite a bit up higher than this one. It's been about four or five years since I upgraded this PC um, and um, it's just not working too well for me. So I'm going to give it a try. I did upgrade, upgrade the power supply to an 850 because I had a 650 in there so I updated that to run this thing and I'm hoping this will work in here now I do have a little bit older CPU and motherboard and all that so I'm gonna give it a try to see if it works with what I have now I'll, I'll flash up here what I have it's a it's the Ryzen 9 3900 CPU uh, some people saying it might bottleneck some people saying it should work so I don't know I'm gonna give it a try first if not I'm gonna have to go through and basically rebuild this whole computer with the new CPU which needs a new motherboard which of course needs new RAM because none of this will fit all that old stuff so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and replace this at least and give it a try and uh, see how well it works so uh, let's see how that works looks like there's a little bit of advertising in here um, I've got some uh, some cable stuff here we've got it looks like a standoff um, system you get the graphics card itself and also some instructions so I'm gonna go ahead and try to put this together Okay, I got the uh, GeForce uh, in here, and this one is uh, was pretty cool. Now, I, I didn't need to use this cable because my new power supply came with a power cable that um, would work. I was able to plug this in and this in. I'm going to cable management this thing, but um, everything is in here nice and good. Uh, this is much bigger than the other one was, but I have a big case, so that's good there. Now, the next thing I do is plug it all in, power it up, and see if it works. I'll let you know if it does and and this little thing here there's no instructions on this um, but it looks like this will unscrew and screw down so if you need to have like a little stand oh it's magnetic too um, maybe a little standoff to stand and hold this up that might be a really cool thing to do this one probably doesn't really fit anywhere maybe I can get it to fit here um, again it doesn't say what it's for but um, I'm just gonna assume that it is a standoff or a thing that will help um, keep this thing uh, supported. Maybe like that. And maybe I'll just put it like that and see how that goes. Okay, I got this, uh, the G-Force plugged in here. Again, this is the uh, uh, 5080. And it works fine with my um, my CPU and my board and everything that I have here. Uh, I did get the new power uh, supply to make sure that it can run. On this thing but it runs fine I uh, I did have to change a few things now I did uh, look look into upgrading or updating the um, the BIOS on my motherboard and just a little warning now I hadn't done it since I got it and there was like 39 versions and I tried the top version and it crashed everything so I had to go back to like the, se the second or third version from uh, when I bought it and it seems to work fine. I'm just going to leave it that as that because it works well uh, for the BIOS um, upgrade. But this thing works well and I've been doing some video editing and it is um, like no problems at all. It's way, way better than the old one without the, uh, the, the skipping and jittering and all that garbage. I'll, I'll show you real quick here a, uh, a sample of the uh, video editing um, using this graphics card. Okay, this is my uh, DaVinci Resolve, and I'm doing a uh, editing a video for a uh, car tent kind of thing. But I just wanted to show you um, that this plays really well. And this is 4K footage. I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to do a scrub. And you can see that it scrubs really well. And then also, this is a time lapse. This is at a thousand uh, speed up, and it just and it just goes like butter. It just smooth, nice and smooth, and goes around there. Um, really, really nice. This is again all 4K footage. This works so much better than it used to. So as you can see, it works really, really well for my circumstances, and it's also supposed to be really good for games. So if you're looking for an upgrade for your PC, you might want to get this one. 